Lily Aramburo has recently given birth to a son named Paulden. Oh, she was the happiest mother. She was dedicated and uh, very proud of her baby. She is also newly engaged to her boyfriend, Christian Pacheco. I thought this is what Lily needs, somebody that can support her emotionally, you know, some, somebody stronger, having already some kind of, like, uh, life going. And I thought it was going to be a good thing. We were in love. We had a good time. We enjoyed each other's company. After a few months of being together, Lily decides to move into Christian's condo in Kendall. I felt as if Lily was on the right track. She was taking care of herself. She seemed fine. At first, things seemed to be going well. Lily was happy to be with Christian. It felt, you know, like we were a family. We would take walks at night together. There were many times we'd go out to the beach, swim in the water, and you know, have fun. But all too soon, Lucelli starts to notice a change in her daughter. I can just tell that she wasn't all that happy. It was just that she wasn't open. She would not tell me what was going on. I thought they were probably having a little bit of, you know, adjusting problems and stuff. I thought being that I hadn't heard from her, I thought it was a good thing. I thought that she was getting her life in order with, with her fiance. What Lily's mother and her friend Janet don't know is that Lily is back on drugs. Both she and Christian have been using heroin and crack cocaine, sometimes for days on end. After three days of that, your mind starts, you know, just playing tricks on you and getting the better of you. And that's where the problem started. You know, she should, should be very agitated, very on edge about the littlest things. Lily and Christian begin fighting frequently. On several occasions, the police are called to the condo. I didn't know they were fighting until one day that they called me up and said that there was an argument at the house and the police was there and child services were involved. That's when I knew they were fighting a lot. Alden was removed from the house. He went to uh, a foster home while Lily was in drug court. Lily is devastated. This day had taken her pride and joy away from her, and I, I couldn't do anything for her. She said, try to be there to console her, um, you know, and talk to her and say, look, you know, we just have to do the right thing. So whatever process they want you to go through, we got to go through. Lily checks into a local rehab program, hoping that she can regain custody of Paulden after a three-month stay. It was a live-in facility, and it was one of the best. So she was very happy about that. She was ready. But after just two weeks, Christian gets a discouraging call from Lily. On Wednesday, she calls me up and says that I'm, I'm out. And uh, she's crying. Lily has relapsed. She had failed a mandatory drug test and was kicked out of the program. 